Let's create another uh, Sally icons for the Brave browser. Let's see. Yay. Brave browser. Yes, it's not coming from the Arch repos. We have a, a, only on the AUR web browser that blocks ads and trackers by default binary release. That's your best choice by far. A binary release is always easy to install. It um, does not need to be built and created. It takes longer to build it and it's um, faster to update if it's a binary. So let's get that in. And let's pause here a little bit. All right, that's installed. Where is Brave? Brave is there and there is already an icon installed for it. So that's strange. I've written it down as a to do on my list here for Farron OS. Brave browser. So let's check on our Nemo in icons. Brave is there, but not Brave Browser. Okay, so on my system, Arch Linux, we have an uh, application that points to Brave. And on Farron OS, they have a package that calls, that installs also the Brave Browser, but the icon name there is Brave Browser. So I don't need to create an icon. I need you to learn something new. What I, do I need you to learn? Basically, do just one example. And of course, uh, you know me. I have a little script for that. Make link in all folders for apps. That's what I'm going to run. Let's, let's, make me, let's make you one example and then delete it and use the script. So what happens if you have an icon? You have an icon. Let's wait for everything to load up. So this is the way to go, guys, if you want to develop and with icons. This is Nemo, right? You need to have Nemo. Why? You do a search and you search for Brave. And you get already an image. You know, oh yeah, that's a nice one. That's the one I want. Okay. So that's easy. Not possible in Tunar. Then um right so let's let me let's just navigate let's again load everything up yep and i'll start typing brave still okay now he's ready let's try again brave here he is now what i need to do they say here I've written it down for myself. So in the GitHub, Eric Dubois Saturday, you can host your, post your issues, stuff that you're missing in your distro, you can put it on here. And so I was on Fern OS and Lion's Head image, blah, blah, blah. Symlink to it, indeed, it's indeed. So this is something that I need to do with a symlink, symbolic link. You open a terminal and then Let's do a mon link. Make links between files. Target is where it's going to point to and the link name. So the link name is actually brave-browser.svg and where it's going to point to is something that exists and here it is. This is the thing that exists already. So that's the target and the new name. Okay. So it's a the world a little bit around i don't know it's just a way of thinking ln min minus s we didn't take a look actually at the s thing so minus s y minus s, 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 s symbolic make symbolic links instead of hard links okay ln minus s it's going to point to something so the two first and then the link that you're now going to make so brave browser svg so any of the fern os guys and of course other distros if you're if it's just this then it's already solved now because this is now a new icon as it were you see there is a new icon it looks like it's a new icon it's a link to this one delete 
this one, Brave SVG, and of course this is broken. So this is not a real icon, nor is this one, nor is that one. There are links pointing to that one, but basically the system doesn't know it. It's a symbolic link. So that solves the issue for the guys on uh, Farron OS. Deleting it here, because I have to do that on every uh, folder here. So you don't see me do that on every folder. So what I do is make a link in all folders for apps. Or why not open that as well? Display. It's not all of the apps, it's the core apps that I need to do. So now you know the core apps as well. In Sardi, there's a Sardi, the colorful one. There's Sardi Flat, without rings. Sardi Flexible, the blue one. Sardi Ghost, the white one. Sardi Mama, all gray. And Sardi Orb is a flat with a ring. And the special surfing. So they all are develop developing at the same point in time. Always. Also surfing. What it says here is go inside every of these uh, folders and do the command. And what's the command? Type complete command to, com to link to with a read command. So I'm going to type the complete command just like I did right now. And then he's going to run that command in that folder, in that folder, in that folder, in that folder. It means I don't have to type the same command side seven times over and over. Okay. Just one time command. Make the link in all folders, type complete command to link to with SVG. First source points to ups. Okay, so all helpful for me, right? ln minus minus s, and then we have our brave.svg. Don't forget the extension, and then brave browser.svg. And he's doing all the work. Done. Now we go in. And we go and have a look at Brave, oops, at Brave, and we get also the Brave browsers with it. So, one, seven of these guys, where do we see that? Here, seven selected items, because Surfen is there. There are six Sardis and one Surfen, check. And the same applies here, seven of the Brave browsers. They're just the same, of course, they're linking to the Brave icon, simple as that. And now this solution of this, this, this thing is solved. So you can make these uh, changes yourself. If you see, hey, there's an icon missing, it's just a symbolic link. There is an icon, but the name has changed. And it often happens, it often happens. These um, changes, for instance, quickly have a look. And the, the GNOME guys have a knack of changing um, their elements. And it all starts with ORC. ORC. So you'll see that when you're working with GNOME, many of these applications all start with ORC.GNOME, etc. And often this has a capital letter as well, so everything is important, capital letters as well. And these are then links that, that go to another Icon. So that's that. Symbolic links are important. There is no need to create an icon for this. There's just a link that we need to make. All right. Enjoy.